we have to clear coat again. You don't really want them to like, you know, like properly like scrape off on the map. So everything I do, I'm going to do a layer on top. And in the description box, I'm going to say everything will leave this when you find the end of that. Thank you. First, I'm going to make it look like it's really shiny, which is what I really like on my nails. And then it looks really healthy and on everything for me when it's done. But this is my part two of this video. Only on like, what, 52 seconds, and I've already done like four nails. So it's like quite quick tutorial. So when like you are uh, minus tutorial though, it does take longer. <laughs> I didn't go on every nail. No one used to think that I did like one on top. So that my thinking is making both of them look naked. So I'm not using this. When I want to be like, just take off lots of flowers. Okay, now. Okay, <laughs> now, so. With any pink you want. I'm going to use a baby baby, like, ish pink for a thin I'm going to use this baby baby ink, and I'll try and show you on the brush, so it doesn't leak. Oops, already leaked. That's really a baby pink. I'm going to use that for the nose. So all I need is the top of this little, like, nail thing. <laughs> I just, like, insert it, so it kind of looks thin. Then lift it up. Actually, that's the size of it. The tiniest brush stone that I've seen. Basically, you can get a dab of that. And you get to look in the nose. You want it nice and small, because it's meant to be trying to fit it on your nails. So it's not like you're doing the texture, but you can have it as big as you want. That's uh, trying to make it as small as you can, and it just works. And then I just go over to make sure all is in place. I'm going to totally right in the back door. Most of you Americans are not going back to school until tomorrow, so don't even know why I know. Yeah. I don't even know why I know, but you know, oh my god. Now basically I'm going to use a hundred more black for the whiskers. So, I'm going to show you now what dot in the nose looks like in the clear coat and that. Just, you know, anything that I like doing. This is far. This is a really you can see my teeth because I did one on top. So basically I love that and that's the first thing like that. And it's just got the nose and that so now on top of this again. This is the whiskers. I'm gonna show you Step by step now with the whiskers for Tara. Just gonna try and learn that. Quite thick. Can you just say that uh Rihanna? Sorry. Mm-hmm. Plus in the tutorial on how to thin don't see how you do the tutorial on how to and the first thing is in his house. This is a question that I get where it goes. Then you can repeat that on every single nail. And it's looking on like, you know, one. That's uh, fine for my stuff. As long as you have the whiskers, because that's my favorite thing about Pelagoo. Okay. This one, 
thing like that for my little thing now. Mm -hmm. Got a glue for it at the end. Where is it? I love this like having parts in here because it's like so small. You don't have to allow this to be on too. Put this on the mirror with the glue. And now basically you're going to do a dark square and bam. Then if you if you only have one eye, I just say they're both covering the other eye because let's see that that's how like my bows go on the side. Oops, next one, this one eye. This one, this one eye. Did it? This one. Yes. No. This one. This one eye. Now you just need to go over with a clear coat. I'll do my clear coat again. I'm going to go up to the other side. She's going to. Sorry, she's a shot up, but no one did. Now I'm just going to put all over a clear coat. And then once it's dry, I'm going to clear coat and then bake it again. See? And I'd like to thank you guys all for watching. So goodbye. Hallelujah. I'm putting no one doing so.